The Turkey Valley Trojans got win number one of the season last week. A happy homecoming as they knocked off West Central 60 to nothing. Head coach Mark Scott joining us. And Mark, uh, after looking at the film of that one, uh, what were the takeaways? Well, kids did, we've got, we're getting better. The kids did a good job of getting on blocks and sustaining them a little longer offensively. And we, you know, executed most of, most of our running plays pretty well. And a few pass plays we executed, we caught them sleeping a couple of times for big, long touchdowns. Defensively, I mean, we did a good job of rallying to the ball, you know, t- starting to get better at tackling. That keeps me improving every week. And within the uh, running game itself, 318 uh, yards uh, on the ground. Uh, Caden Schmidt with a very nice night with 183 yards and three touchdowns. Uh, how has Caden uh, progressed uh, throughout the season? Once again, you know, he's a sophomore. He's getting some more varsity carries this year, obviously. And last last week, you know, situations dictated that he carried it more than normal. And, um, and he did a good job. I mean, he's got good eyes. He got he, he sees the field well. Sees his blockers. Doesn't you know? He sticks his nose in there when he needs to stick his nose in there. And he's you know he's getting better. He's getting stronger and faster. And how has uh, your line progressed uh, here through three weeks? Saying they're getting better. I mean, they're like I said, we're getting on, on we're getting a little doing a better job of getting on blocks and staying on blocks instead of just making contact and thinking you're done. You know, finishing it out. So they're getting better at that. We're, once again, we're you know we're pretty young up front. So, I mean, yeah, that's that's the big thing. Staying on their blocks. They know where they're going. They just got to you know keep there. And, you know, it's not just hit and go. It's hit and drive. And it, does it uh, take, especially with young linemen, uh, a couple of three games to uh, get used to uh, how you need to do that at the varsity level? It seems to be that's the case, yes. <laughs> as they uh, get ready for another week this week, you're back on the road as you take on El Cater Central. Uh, what are you expecting Friday night? They got some athletes. The Hammerslands kids are both athletic. The Borman kid, I think he, is, he qualified for state wrestling last year. He makes a lot of tackles for them. Um, looks like they'd like to run the ball, so we're going to have to tackle. They throw, they throw it some, but the majority of their – Mindset seems to be quite similar to ours. If they can run it, they're going to run it. All right, uh, Coach. Hopefully you can make it to two in a row uh, this week. Uh, keep your kids healthy. We wish you best of luck. Thank you, sir. Mark Scott, head coach of the Turkey Valley Trojans. Trojans and Ocator Central this Friday night.